Wepner comes in. Ali still has only thrown about three or four combinations in the entire fight. Wepner just can't get through the way Ali knows how to protect himself. And Ali will give him his ribs. Ali can take his best shots. Wepner has a glazed look in his eye like uh, he's beginning to tire and dragging his right foot behind him a little bit as Ali continues to bounce around a little bit. ways by Wepner, but nothing with the type of movement, the fluidity that Muhammad Ali would have when he does the same type of thing. Beginning to see the blood spurting across the eye of Chuck Wepner. Wepner turning his head away from Ali now when he puts that left in his face. It's the right hand that you're going to have to watch out for, because when Ali unloads that on top of that cut, it'll split it wide open. We'll look for right hand momentarily here. Wepner walks right into the left jab of Ali. Wepner not concerned with the left jab at all. He just takes the punch. Ali faints the top part of his body back and slips a punch to his left. Oh, a vicious shot to the rib of Muhammad Ali, and what a surprise. Chuck Wetner gets to the body of Muhammad Ali. Now let's see what happens here. We've got a count of six, seven, and now it's the mandatory eight count. Muhammad Ali actually went down. A vicious right hand thrown by Wetner. Ali is now going to have to get off his punches and start the fight. This is no joke. Ali was surprised. It was a right hand that dropped Ali. 